What's going on, everyone? Titus here with Real Breaks. We're going to get rolling with 2021 Leaf Lumber Kings. This is number four. Amel's got number five. This is break battle number four. And uh, Kyle is on top of it. He knows what's up. This is our last two cases, so nothing to choose from. But uh, thank you, Nick, for coming in. <laughs> Trying to steal Kyle's thunder. But let's do this. Let's dig in. So I'm prepared to use a ton of 180 point top loaders. <laughs> and I have ripped this product in the past, but uh, this will be my first case of 2021. So super excited, hoping for some, hoping for some bat knobs or some barrels. <laughs> Let's get our mitt out and we'll get started. What's up, Michael? So just a quick note on this product. I know there is some uh, you know, some discretion that has to go into what teams these cards are going to. We'll try to use our best uh, judgment uh, based off the context of the card and the jersey that they show or the events that are uh, stated on the card to uh, try to make a call. But if needed, uh, probably just defer to Ryan and set him aside. Sorry, Nick. Tom Tom wasn't nice to you. Why could he do that? All right, here we go. Mike Piazza right off the bat. That looks like a Dodgers uniform, but seriously, like I'm questioning myself right off the bat. <laughs> Nick, you can uh, you can pick next time. Mike Piazza. Yeah, it does not say a team on it, but it sure looks like Dodgers to me. Dodgers would be going to Chris Raffi. Jeff Kent, 22 of 25. 1,500 RBI Club dual bat relic. So that one will be going to the Giants. UCLA upsets Michigan. Uh-oh, where's Kevin? <laughs> where's Kevin? Giants on this one are going to Eric Miller. The franchise Cubbies, two of nine, Ryan Sandberg, Billy Herman, Mark Grace, and Billy Williams. Cubs are going to Kerry Myers. Kerry, you got the Cubs? <laughs> Carlos, I mean, all supplies have already shot up big time, but I don't know. I mean, I guess it wouldn't surprise me at this point. About Dave Winfield, Fred McGriff, Steve Garvey, Ken Caminati, uh, Roberto Alomar, Joe Carter, Tony Gwynn, and Fernando Tatis Jr. Are those all Padres? Looks like a lot of Padres uniforms on there. <laughs> oh, it does say San Diego Super Teams. Yep. Number five of six Padres to Chris Raffi. So the big twist in this one, I hear Animal talking about it too, and uh, it's going to come into play here. So multiplayer cards, you score one point per car or per player on it uh, as a bonus. So there's between it being a one player and uh, a duel is two points because no extra points for just being a one person and then two extra points for being a duel. So let's go ahead and score our first box here. So this one, number five of six. Uh, so that's going to be three points for the card. And then we've got an extra eight on there. So 11. So this one is numbered out of nine, so three plus four players on it, so seven. And then this one is going to be one point, and Piazza for one point, so another two there. So 18, 20 points. 20 points in number one. Yeah, I don't know, Carlos. I think, for the most part, those supplies are getting used anyways, and then people are taking them out to grade. So, I don't know that uh, there's any more supplies that get used. Hello, Barb. How's it going? And the winner of the battle is going to get an extra box of this added to the break. Oh, 
Let's in the mid. Uh, it is a eight piece relic of uh, Padres. Greg Biggio, nine of twelve. Three thousand hit club. It's gonna be going to the Astros. <laughs> Saw that, Nick. Astros to Aaron James Watson. <laughs> Jen, I have a mountain of those top loaders. If anybody uh, wants to buy some. <laughs> Nickname fame, Brooks Robinson, 9 of 9. Human vacuum cleaner. <laughs> In other words, he's a suck up. Going to the Orioles for Kyle Keller. separate bat rack three pete rose tony perez and frank robinson going to the reds reds to joshua hewitts copsy is buying 10 cents a piece i might send them in seriously <laughs> four of 20 on that one and our first auto don mattingly signature sticks nine of 30 don mattingly excuse me in a yankees uniform yankees to matt hastings I guess I would assume Matt is Yankees, right? You even play for anyone else? Don Mattingly out of 30. All right, so here's our score for this. We should have bonus points if they're uh, if they're auto too. So one point for that one. Plus this one's out of 20, so just one point plus three players, so four points. Nickname Fame nine of nine is gonna be three points. And then this one is out of 12, so three points. So 11 there. Here's just a 31. That Magli Auto up there. Yeah, Carlos, I guess I just don't use as much as many top loaders as I get uh, from buying stuff. <laughs> I have a ton of extra top loaders. Like thousands. Cool, and here we got a little barrel, game used lumber. Rafael Palmero, so it looks a lot like a Rangers uniform. Rangers to Kerry Myers. Good luck on those, Nick. Hope you do well. Cal Ripken Jr., 2 of 3, 1500 RBI club. Going to the Orioles, another nice one for you, Kyle. Mount Crushmore, Sammy Sosa, Ron Santo, Ryan Sandberg, and Chris Bryant. That's pretty cool. 35 of 35, too. And decade versus decade, 50s and 70s. Ted Williams, Duke Snyder, Joe Morgan, Jim Rice, Pete Rose, Rock Guru, Mickey Mantle, and Stan Musial. <laughs> That is cool, and that is going to have to hit the randomizer. Jeez. That is really cool. All right, so let's do our points here for this one. This one is numbered 5 of 9, which makes it 3 points plus the 8, so 11 point. Plus Mount Crushmore is going to be just the base 1 plus 4 players, so 5. And then two of three on the rip gain for five. And then Palmero's on a four for another five. This is a big box. So 15, 26 point box. Brings us to 57. Let's see, let's put this one up there. There are a couple of Red Sox on there, Jed. 
So again, uh, if one team has the majority or one person owns the majority, then it does not go to the random. But uh, yeah, we'll have to go through. We'll have to go through on that one. Figure out all the teams we got. <laughs> Bradley, if it makes you feel any better, uh, Carrie is also a Cubs collector, and he got the Cubs in this one. So. I'm sure you were, Nick. <laughs> you got a chance at it, Tim. You got a chance with Carew. These people are going to be sweating out randoms in this one. Nice, Carlos. We've got a ton of 1920 Prism cellos, but uh, 18 Prism is nice. We got some 18 Prism Megas and I think Cellos here for uh, football. George Brett, 8 of 25, Royals to Trey Blanchard. Oh, that one's cracked on the side. I don't want to use that one. Nickname fame, Don Baylor, 16 of 25, Groove was his nickname. Uh, kind of looks like an Orioles uniform, but eh, maybe not. Maybe that's red. I'm not familiar with Don Baylor. I apologize. A lot of these guys are way before my time. So I'm going to do a quick search for Don Baylor. Let's see. And feel free to chime in. Hall of Famer. Yeah, it looks like Orioles. Angels. Okay, yeah, let's see. It was with the Orioles from 70 to 75. With the Angels for five years, too. He's with several teams. Do we think that's an Angels uniform? I guess it could be. Yeah, it's really hard to tell. See that looks more like orange to me. Do we know what do we know what number he wore at either of those teams? <laughs> he did he did spend two years with the Red Sox. <laughs> oh man, we might have to uh revisit this one. <laughs> we might have to come back to it. <laughs> Sounds like Emil might have a bat knob though. Alright, TBD on this one. TBD. <laughs> George Bretts, Jim Rice, and Harold Baines. Three home run games, four of 20. So that'll let the randomizer. We have the Choice Prism Basketball. Oh, uh, we do. And I actually have an 18 Prism Choice box myself that I'm sitting on trying to decide when to sell. <laughs> Kyle, 7 of 15. Signature Sticks, Cal Ripken Jr. Thank you, Jed. I appreciate the... Uh, the research assistant. Cal Ripken Jr. to the Orioles and Kyle Keller. There you go, Kyle. I told you I thought the Orioles would probably be a good one in this. You're crushing it. All right, so points here. This one is out of 15, so that's three points. This one is out of 20, so that's one point plus three players, so four. Uh, Baylor is out of 25 for one. And then George Brett's also on a 25 for one. So not going to score as many points there. Just nine points. Brings us to 66. That's a mid hit. All right, fine. All right, fine, Kyle. Just for all the cases you picked. <laughs> Here you go, buddy. And Gong, no, don't push your luck. <laughs> Bradley says Angels on the checklist. Does it actually have that one as Angels? If it does, then that's our problem solved. I know a lot of the stuff like does not even have a 
does not even have a uh, team name, at least on the checklist I'm looking at. I want cardboard connections. Is there a checklist that lists team names? Masada, nine of nine. Uh, top, top hits in this are the bat knobs. Oh, there's like literally everybody has a bat knob. <laughs> Masada, nine of nine Yankees to Matt Hastings. Frank Robinson, nickname fame, one of nine, Judge. Another one for you, Kyle. Kerry, how you doing, man? We've had some nice Cubs for you. I know you'll appreciate those. Lumber numbers, number four, number four of four. That's nice. Paul Molitor, Billy Herman, Mel Otts, and Sam Chapman. Okay, I'm going to be honest. I know Paul Molitor, and that's a Brewers uniform. Uh, I am not sure on those other ones. Mel Ott I've heard of. Those other two I've not heard of even. <laughs> So group break checklist does have uh, All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to open it up. Let's see. All right, I just want to see, like, I know some team or some players are, like, have cards for multiple teams. We'll find somebody that shows both teams. Or 25 for all three teams mentioned. Oh, that's not helpful. <laughs> Come on, change up your numbers every once in a while, why don't you? Uh, let's see. I'm seeing all the same teams listed for each player. Let's see, what's another one in here that uh, would be multiple teams? We'll revisit it. We'll come back to it. Jim Tomey is here. That is definitely a Phillies uniform. Five of 30. <laughs> Do it, Tim. Paste the whole checklist in. No, don't. <laughs> Phillies to Chris Raffi. <laughs> we got to score this one still. Jim Tomey. It's going to be one point. Four of four on this one is going to be nine points. Frank Robinson, one of nine for three. And then Passat out of nine for another three. So 16 points. Brings us to 82. <laughs> Let's do it, Bradley. Let's end it. Let's see. We'll set all these aside for now. What was the card again? Uh, are you talking about the tri the this last one? Molitor, Herman, Otz, and Chapman. So we'll go through them all at the end of the break. We're gonna have to random them off, so <laughs> we'll go through that and uh, do our detective work. better you get to watch me online <laughs> say we so so seven to nine Sosa to the Cubs and Kerry Myers tape measure taters three of ten 
Jim Tomey. So 511 feet on June 3rd, 1999. Uh, is that Indians then? <laughs> hmm. <laughs> we'll look that up. Or somebody look up. Somebody look up who is with the 99. <laughs> Because we definitely had a Phillies one earlier. That Otto is definitely wearing a Phillies uniform. Lumber numbers four and five: Ozzy Smith, Paul Weiner, Bobby Doerr, and Tony Fernandez. Four of five. Uh, Carrie, I don't think there's been any White Sox exclusive hits. They might have been on one of these uh, ones that we need to random them off. <laughs> Cleveland in 99. So, all right, so this is what I'm saying. Let me look up Jim Tomey and see if do they have him with multiple teams because, like, this is going to go to the to the Indians. Let's see. Let me scroll to him. Jim Tomey. Yeah, see, they have Jim Tomey listed for Indians on all of them, but that is 100% a Phillies uniform, right? So I'm going to say that we cannot trust, we cannot trust the group break checklist on these ones. But how about this card? Bat Rack 3. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Babe Ruth, Mickey Mantle, and Roger Maris, number two of four. Yankees to Matt Hastings. <laughs> Hello. Oh my goodness. So that was on the that was on the group break checklist one. That was on the uh, let's see. That was on the group break player checklist. So, four of five here on this one. Gives us five points plus four players, so nine. And three Yankees on here. So, number four for five plus three players, so eights. Tape measure taters. Jib tell me. That's numbered out of ten. So, three points. And then Sosa out of nine. It's going to be three points. All right, so 17, 20, 23 in box six. Brings us to 105. Let's see. I'll toss this one in the mid. You can not have that one in the mid. Yeah, I think on this product, I think on this product is not from the manufacturer. They're just, they, I bet they probably did like most, most games played Whatever team they played the most games with, that's what they put on the checklist. See you later, Nick. See you later. Have a good one. Use the group break team checklists. All right, let me pull that one up. Okay, so then if I go to Phillies, am I going to see uh, Jim tell me? Yeah, see, like, I don't see that Jim Tomey on the Phillies checklist, is what I'm saying. Bill Mazeroski for the Pirates. 10 of 20. Pirates to Brennan Garzion. Group break team checklist is right. I, like I said, I'm not seeing... 
Am I just missing the Jim Tomey on the Phillies checklist then? I see Utley, and then it goes to Jimmy Rollins. Jeff Bagwell, 2 of 4, 1500 RBI club. Going to the Astros. Astros to Aaron James Watson. Mount Crushmore, Galarraga, Larry Walker, Todd Helton, and Ellis Burks. Those are all Rockies. One of three Rockies to Trey Blanchard. I might, I might, Carlos. I might need the, the double decker showcase here. <laughs> this Mount Crushmore out of three. 1982 All Star game, 13 of 20. We got Andre Dawson, Mike Schmidt, Bob Horner, Dale Murphy. Ricky Henderson, Willie Nelson, Robin Younts, and Fred Lynn. That's pretty cool. 13 of 20. Midsummer Classic. It's like for this one, it's easy. You can just look up 1982 and solve your problems on what team everyone was on. All right. Points here in box seven. We've got this one's out of 20 for one. Well, I guess plus eight, though. So nine. One's out of three for five, plus four players, another nine. Bagwell's two of four for five. Mazeroski out of 20 for one. Well, let's see, 18, 19, 24. Gives us to 129. I think I like this one better than that Padres one. That's what I'm saying. It shows all the Tommy cards under the Indians team list, and he's definitely wearing a Phillies uniform on that card. So we're giving it to Phillies based off of that. So I'm fine using most games played, like like whatever team they use the most games with as like a tiebreaker if we can't tell. But if we can see what uh, what uniform it is, then. Did I say Willie Nelson? Uh, no, I said Willie Willie Wilson. Willie Wilson is on this one. Mike Easler, five of nine. I am not familiar with Mike Easler, but that uh, sure looks like the Pirates team colors. Pirates would be to Brennan Garzion. Late round legends, Tim Raines, six of six. Was Reigns like the Expos? Let's see. Yeah, so Nationals. Nationals on this one. So Bradley Noel. There you go, Bradley. <laughs> right on cue. Eddie Murray, Joe Carter, and Reggie Jackson home run games. Two of four. Dual auto. There we go. Fred Lynn and Jim Rice, 415 to the Red Sox and Jed Foster. <laughs> How's that one, Jed? <laughs> Signature sticks, dual. Jeez. All right. So Fred Lynn and Jim Rice out of fifth, or sorry, yep, out of 15. Going to be five points. Eddie Murray, Joe Carter, and Reggie Jackson, two of four. It's going to be eight points. Late round legend, six of six. Tim Raines is going to be three points. And Game Easy Lumber, Mike Easler, five of nine. It's going to be three points. All right, so 13, 16, 19 points. So let's see, 139, 148. 
Joe's Dawson in Cubs uniform, but 82 is with Expos. So, I mean, on those ones, on these ones, I'm going to go with whatever team he was with on in 82. So, if they're commemorating a specific date, then I'm going to go with whoever they were with uh, on that date. That one is all yours, Jed. No, uh, no debate there. Two boxes left. Jim Rice gave me his lumber. 11 of 25 Red Sox to Jet. Got some more top loaders here. Yeah. Uh, just count it as the base. Yeah. Tony Perez, International Icons, 8 of 25 to the Reds and Joshua Hewitts. Lumber Leaders, AL 1985, 7 of 7, Mattingly, Wade Boggs, George Brett, and Ricky Henderson. Oh, there it is. It's like two Yankees on there, but kind of have a majority. Kind of have a majority to, uh, well, not going to have over 50%. So I'm going to have 51% or more. Garvey, Robin Younts, Johnny Bench, Mickey Mantle, Bobby Doerr, Eddie Matthews, Tim Raines, and Dave Parker. Legendary lineup, 12 of 25. Well, 25 is going to be your one point. Or no, not one point. Nine points. We've got eight people on it. Lumber leaders out of seven will be three plus the four people on there. So seven. Tony Perez for one. And Jim Rice out of 25 for one. Well, it's going to be 18 points in box nine. I hate this pen. <laughs> it's one of those ones that like, it like twists open and closed. So I'm like trying to write it and it's like twisting closed. <laughs> Jen, this is a fun one. We're going to have a lot of randoms to run now. <laughs> Sorry, Michael. We'll try to pull a Braves exclusive card for you. You'd think Braves would be a really good one to have here. Frank Thomas, one of three game used lumber. White Sox to carry Myers. What all the randoms for this round? I'm going to try to do them right at the end of the break, but if there's any that we're not sure on or that there's disputes on, I will hold off on. One of 25, Dave Winfield, Padres. Padres to Chris Raffi. <laughs> Jenny, going to come over and uh, dice them up for us? <laughs> Lumber leaders. AL 1983, 6 of 12. Wade Boggs, Jim Rice, Cal Ripken Jr., and Ricky Henderson. So again, like Red Sox have two on here, but not enough to uh, avoid the randomizer. Yeah, Kerry did really well. Did you get anything with the Rangers? I can't remember anything for the Rangers. Maybe there was. I'm just forgetting it. Midsummer Classic. 
2002 All-Star Grand. That's more my time period. <laughs> Todd Helton, Scott Rowland, Jimmy Rollins, Adam Dunn, Ichiro, Jorge Posada, Derek Jeter, and Pedro Martinez. Alright, so eight piece there to close it out. So three of nine on that one is going to be three plus eight players, so 11. Then this one is out of 12 for seven with all those players on it. Then out of 25 for one. And then Frank Thomas out of three for five. So 18, 19, 24. All right, so we finished out 190. We'll see what Amel's at. <laughs> I hope we got the extra box. Oh, the, yeah, the Palmero, that's right. Amel, you still have two boxes left? Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, all right, nap time, guys. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> 190? Oh, I'll be back in this box here. <laughs> Wait, what are you at? Huh? What are you at? I'm at 149. With two to go? Doesn't that come down to the wire? You want to come in here and watch this with me? I was at, I was at 148 with two to go. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> I'm going to start working on my randoms. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to go through and just pull out any card that uh, is going to have to go to the randomizer, and we can start working on them. Oh, man. It's San Diego, Rockies. Let's see. That one needs to go. So, I think this is our stack to do, <laughs> plus, uh, plus the ones up there. Let's see, we can start working on this. These are the players or teams, of course you're faster. I mean, I guess, <laughs> I guess I knew most of the players. I don't know if I want to do it on a separate sheet. Let me just, let's just zoom out a little bit. All right, so let's see. I think what I'll do is I'm gonna like label the cards. So legendary lineup. Let's see. There we go. For both break battles to put both breaks streaming streaming on the same video. I mean I can pull up <laughs> I can pull up animals and we can we can do a watch party. <laughs> Cause you can just watch my desktop. <laughs> but okay, so legendary lineup. Here. We'll put the card in question on the showcase here. So Steve Garvey's gotta be Dodgers. And then Robin Yount, Brewers. Johnny Bench, Reds. Mickey Mantle, Yankees. This one's pretty easy so far. <laughs> All right. And then Bobby Doerr. Uh, 190. Oof. 
Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I know, I had a lot of 15 point boxes. <laughs> All right, so Doors, Red Sox. I have one 15 point box. They're up over. So that's the only year 15 points to buy titles. Let's see. Eddie Matthews, Braves. Yep, Door, Red Sox. I got that one. Uh, Tim Raines, Nationals. And then Dave Parker. That looks like Pirates. Is that correct? Let's see, Dave Parker. Yep, Pirates. All right, so this one is all taken care of. We got Dodgers, Brewers, Reds, Yankees, Red Sox, Braves, Nationals, and Pirates. So that can be one. <laughs> all set on that one. All right, 2002 All Star Game. Right, 2002 All Star Game. We got Todd Helton. So I'm going like I'm going like this. We got Rockies. Scott Rowland and Jimmy Rollins are both going to be Phillies. So Chris gets on there twice for that. Let's see. Adam Dunn at the bottom there. That's Reds. Ichiro Mariners. I mean, I guess I better confirm that each row was on the Mariners in 2008, or sorry, 2002. Let's see. Let's see. row in 2002, yes, was with the Mariners. And uh, Posada is next up, Yankees. And then Derek Jeter, hmm, I wonder what team he is. Uh, and then Pedro for the Red Sox. All right, so we're good on that one. Next up, uh, three home run games. All right, George Brett for the Royals. Jim Rice, Red Sox. And then Harold Baines, White Sox. All right, it's Paul Molitor. Brewers there. All right, wait, I gotta write this down. Ah, dang it. Dang it. All right, I'll bring Amla's box and then we'll, we'll keep going on this. good point if we're not sure what we're gonna do is or what he's gonna do for all of his randoms is he's actually gonna random off the uh and how about one more box he's going to random off the the player names That's all, Titus, take care of that. all right so paul Molitor is first on here so just if we're not sure we'll just put the player name and then we can decide the afterwards on it <laughs> i just don't like opening extra boxes i know the four extra cards are just a killer <laughs> All right, Billy Herman. Billy Herman, Cubs. Looks good to me. Yep, yeah, so just 
For like, if we know if we know what the team is, then I'll I'm fine just doing the doing the players. Mel Otts, that does not look like a Giants jersey. Let's see. But he only played for the Giants, okay? <laughs> and then Sam Chapman is the final one on here. Chapman, they have on here is A's. I think that's A's uniform. Maybe not. It's like it looks like it's blue and yellow. Another decade versus decade with seventies versus the two Yep, New York Giants. Alright, uh Sam Chapman looks like played for Philadelphia A's and Cleveland Indians, but was with Philadelphia A's for almost his whole career. So A's it is to Nathan Hess. Yeah, so that covers that one. What was the break score? Uh, Abel, what was your final score? Uh, I didn't count after I started beating you. Oh. So you stopped counting after you passed me. It was 175, and then in my first two cards, I got up to 191 or something. So you beat me by two cards at least. <laughs> All right. Lumber numbers one. So this one is Ozzy Smith, Cardinals. Next one is Paul Wayner. Let's see, I got my Pirates on here. Let me just confirm. All these old guys. I can't tell what those uniforms are. <laughs> yeah, looks like he played 14 years for the Pirates. Parts are Brennan Garzion. Who oh, said Dora's Red Sox? Red Sox are Jed. Tony Fernandez, that looks like a Blue Jays uniform. Just confirm. Yep. All right, Blue Jays are going to Blair. Oops. All right, so that takes care of that one. Next up, three home run games. Wayner wore one with the Dodgers only. I guess it does look like a Dodgers uniform. So let's, uh, I'll just put him in. Thanks for looking that up. I appreciate that actually. Lumber numbers. So, okay, so I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take Pirates out. I'm just gonna put his name. I'm just gonna put Paul Wayner. And I will let Ryan hash that one out, so. If Paul Wayner ends up winning, then uh, we will let Ryan decide on that one. All right, so Eddie Murray is going to be Orioles. Joe Carter. Next up, let me just confirm here. Yep, no, I appreciate it, guys. It, that's probably what I'll do is if uh, there's, like, guys that played for multiple teams, I'll have you guys investigate a little bit. So if it's not their uh, primary team that's pictured on there. So let's see, Joe Carter here. Oh, okay, it says 1986. In 86, he is playing for the Indians. And then Reggie Jackson, 86. Let's see, Reggie Jackson in 86 was with the Angels. Yeah, I guess, uh, I guess you guys probably want to see the card. So I say I can show you my desktop view, but you guys probably want to see the cards. 
as I'm investigating. Right, lumber leaders. Oops. All right, Don Mattingly. Yankees, Wade Boggs, Red Sox. George Brett's Royals. And then Ricky Henderson. It looks like Yankees, but let me confirm on him. Yeah, and it could be one where he's pictured with the Yankees and was actually with a different team at that time. So 85, yes, he was with the Yankees. All right, we're getting down to the wire here. Alright, uh, another Lumber Leaders. So Wade Boggs and Jim Rice both going to be Red Sox. Ripken Orioles, and then Henderson, 83, is A's. Right, so that covers that one. Okay, and then on the showcase, so we got this one up here. Couple eight piecers. <laughs> so this is 1982 All Star Game. Somebody pull up the uh, 82 All Star Game roster just to uh, be prepared. <laughs> but going uh, on the left side first, and then the right side. We're starting off with Andre Dawson. So this is the one somebody said Andre Dawson was not with the Cubs, I believe. Let's see. So I'm going with whatever team they're on in 1982. So 82, he was. Uh, Expo, so Nationals. All right, and then Mike Schmidt, I'm assuming Phillies. Dale, or sorry, I skipped over Bob Horner. Let's see. Let's see, they have his Braves. It looks like a Braves uniform. Do a Wikipedia search quick. Yep, Braves it is. And then Dale Murphy, same thing, right? Next up, Fred Lynn. Gotta be Red Sox, right? Well, you gotta keep in mind, I didn't watch any of these guys play. Uh, looks like 82 Angels, so not Red Sox. He was Red Sox till 1980. So, I, I mean, I did, grew up, I did grow up with baseball cards of a lot of these guys. <laughs> and like, I sent a lot of like through the mail autographs and stuff too, so. Yount is going to the Brewers. Willie Wilson. If that's not a Royals uniform, somebody had some ugly uniforms. <laughs> Let's see. Willie Wilson. There's too many Willie Wilsons. Where's baseball player? I think came up. Hmm. It is Royals, it looks like, on group break checklist. So I'm going with it. All right, and then Ricky Henderson. Again, we determined 82. That's 83, but it was with A's through at least 83. 
All right, so that one's taken care of. I'm gonna put it here on my stack. 50s versus 70s. This one could get tough. So let's do the top row first and then bottom row on this. The Bay McDowell, I think I got that one. I think I did have him. I think I remember that one. Let's see, Ted Williams on top. Red Sox. Duke Snyder. Oops. That's not what I wanted. Uh, Dodgers. Okay, I was like, I was like, what? Because I remember him for Dodgers too, but I was looking at that jersey, but that's mutual. Alright, so next up, Joe Morgan. Reds, right? What the heck? Mike Sell's like being slow now. Come on. No. <laughs> Copy the Reds. There we go. And then Jim Rice, Red Sox. But didn't we have Jim Rice for another team earlier? So let me check. So that's tough because it doesn't actually give us, uh, it doesn't give us a year, it just gives us a decade. <laughs> so, oh no, Jim Rice is only Red Sox. Never mind. All right, so down to the bottom row, Stan Musial, Cardinals. And Mickey Mantle. Rod Carew. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it looks like a twins uniform on there. And then Pete Rose. Okay, so that takes care of that one. That, and that is it. <laughs> Oof. That is a lot. <laughs> so, really the only one in question is the Paul Wainer, right? At least the only one in question for the random. There could be other ones where we're not sure what it's, but it's just a single player. So, uh, let's go ahead and recap first, and then I'm going to run these randoms. Let's do this. Thank you for your help, guys. I appreciate it. Cal Ripken Jr., two of three. Mount Crushmore of Sosa, Santos, Sandberg, and Bryant out of 35. BG out of 12. Uh, Brooks Robinson, nine of nine. Jeff Kent out of 25. Herman, Sandberg, Grace, and Williams out of nine. Uh, three of 10. Jim Tomey, tape, me tape measure taters. Jim Tomey, signature sticks, five of 30. Frank Robinson, one of nine. Football time, yeah, as soon as we run these randoms. Got some random surround and then uh, it'll be football time. Don Baylor. So this is one of the ones that's uh, in question. Uh, kind of looks like an Angels uniform, but I don't know. We're going to have to research <laughs> research the uniforms of the days. Dave Winfield out of 25. International Icons Perez. Uh, late Round Legends Tim Raines, 6 of 6. San Diego Super Teams for the Padres, 5 of 6. Mount Crushmore for the Rockies, 1 of 3. Galarraga, Walker, Helton, and Ellis Burks. Bagwell, 2 of 4. Bat Rack, 3. Pete Rose, Tony Perez, Frank Robinson out of 20. Piazza out of 25. Brett out of 25. Palmero out of 4. Posada out of 9. Sosa out of 9. Mazeroski out of 20. Easler out of 9. Jim Rice out of 25. And Thomas out of 3. Nice Frank Thomas there. All right, so then these are the ones that uh, are going to hit the randomizer. Lumber leaders, Boggs, Rice, Ripken, and Henderson out of 12. Uh, lumber leaders, 85. Mattingly, Boggs, Brett, and Henderson out of 7. Three home run games out of 4. Eddie Murray, Joe Carter, and Reggie Jackson. Lumber numbers, number 1. 4 of 5, Ozzie Smith, Paul Wainer, Bobby Doerr, and Tony Fernandez. Lumber numbers 4, numbered 4 of 4. Paul Molitor, Billy Herman, Mel Ott, and Sam Chapman. 
Three home run games out of 20. George Brett, Jim Rice, and Harold Baines. Midsummer Classic 2002 All-Star Game is Helton, Roland, Rollins, uh, Adam Dunn, Ichiro, Posada, Jeter, and Martinez. And legendary lineup, Garvey, Younts, Bench, Mantle, Dorr, Matthews, Reigns, and Dave Parker. All right, on to the showcase. Fred Lynn and Jim Rice. Signature sticks duel out of 15 for the Red Sox. Red Sox to Jed Poster. Midsummer Classic, eight piece. It'll hit the randomizer. Dawson, Schmidt, Bobby, or sorry, Bob Horner, uh, Dale Murphy, Fred Lynn, Robin Younts, Willie Wilson, Ricky Henderson. Decade versus Decade, 50s versus 70s. Williams, Snyder, Morgan, Jim Rice, Musial, Mantle, Carew, and Pete Rose. Cal Ripken Jr., signature sticks, 7 of 15. Going to the Orioles for Kyle Keller. Don Mattingly, signature sticks out of 30 for the Yankees and Matt Hastings. And your money mint hit of the break. How cool is this card? Bat Rack 3. Babe Ruth, Mickey Mantle, and Roger Maris, 2 of 4 for the Yankees and Matt Hastings. Congratulations on that one, Matt. Let's go ahead and run some randoms. <laughs> this should be fun. Oh, man. All right. So, random time. Let me pull up our break post. Switch it over to the desktop. So, here we go. Here is going card by card. So we'll start off with our legendary lineup. Again, I'll try to show you guys. So this is the card that we're gonna do first. Uh, I guess, here, let's go over and do a new giveaway. I'm just gonna do abbreviations. I'm gonna do LK4. Then we'll paste that in. I'm never going to do date because we're going to have to do this so many times. <laughs> Let's copy this one. Paste it in. Eight entries, Dodgers on top, Pirates on the bottom. Next one's got to be four or higher. We're going nine rounds. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. It's like Yankees and Mats. Rich get richer. All right, so Matt, congratulations on that one. So we're gonna let's highlight the winner in each of these two, so we know which ones we've done. Let's paste that in. Let's copy this. All right, I don't know if that's the best way to do it, but we'll make it work. Okay, number four. I guess just type this one. All right, two thousand two All Star Game. You guys have already seen these. Let's just run, let's just run the randoms. Rockies on top, Red Sox on the bottom. Uh, let me just confirm that nobody has a majority. Five rounds this time. There's one, two, three. I mean, Yankees are well represented on a lot of these. So, one more round. Reds to Joshua Hewitt. Winning this one. All right, so Adam Dunn comes through. Next up is three home run games, number one. We have two of these. All right, so Royals on top, White Sox on the bottom for this one. One, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Looks like Carey's getting that one with the White Sox. So lumber numbers four. Four entries. We got Brewers on top, A's on the bottom. Next one's got to be four or higher. Going seven rounds. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. I think Carrie's getting that one as well. There are two different spots. The first one you run. Or that last one he won with the White Sox. This one is with the Cubs. All right, so this is the one that we're not sure on Paul Wainer, so he is going to be in place of whatever team we decide that he would go to. <laughs> but uh, it doesn't matter that it doesn't have, like, the team name or anything. It's still four entries, so you can see that. So Cardinals, Paul Wainer, Red Sox, or Blue Jays. That's just going to be four or higher. Going six rounds. There's one, two, three, four. Five and six. Looks like Blair is our winner on that one with the Blue Jays. There you go. We don't even need to figure out the Paul Wiener situation. Let's go to Blair. All right. Next up, I think that's our last one. So we've got a three home run games, number two. Or here, I'm gonna copy this first. So many randoms. All right, Orioles on top, Angels on the bottom. Next one's gotta be four or higher. Going eight rounds. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Eric's taking that one home with the Angels. All right, next up, Lumber Leaders, 85. Let me copy this first, though. All right, Yankees on top for Matt, and it's Yankees on the bottom for Matt as well. Which is going to be four or higher. Again, he would need to have three of the spots to have it not random. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. It's like Dre's taking it home with the Royals.
Crazy when he randoms all over the place. He just won Amos too. <laughs> All right, new giveaway. This is Lumber Leaders 83. Let's see. Oops. So Jed's got two here. Jed, you got to win one of these. Right, Jed's got the top two and then Nathan on the bottom. Going five rounds. One. Two, three, four, and five. Nathan wins. Jed, I'm killing you. I'm sorry. Keep rolling. We got two left. This is nineteen eighty two All Star Game. All right, Nationals on top, A's on the bottom. This one's gonna be four or higher. Going with seven rounds. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Nathan with back to back W's. Look at that. All right, final random. Come on, right up. You might have to, Nathan. You got the jackpot. You're winning randoms here. <laughs> nice night for you. Red Sox on top here. We got Reds on the bottom. Going nine rounds. Is this the one with Carew on it? It is. This is the one with Carew on it. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight and nine. There you go, Jed. Jed won one. All right, so that is going to do it for this one. Thank you guys for being patient with me and helping me out on the research and uh, being patient while I ran all those randoms. But that does it for this break. We'll be live here in just a minute with football. I know Amos still running some randoms, so give it out for uh, him to finish those up, and then we will go live with our last break of the night, that uh, break battle number five. Here's Amos post for it. Second uh, football break battle. So thanks, guys. We'll see you in just a minute.